Auto Focus is a brand new channel that joined YouTube on the 21st of August 2022 and already has 300,000 views. This is astronomical coming from an already experienced creator. In this video today, we are going to talk about the creator of the channel Auto Focus, so make sure to watch till the end. But before we begin, please support us by looking at those subscribing to our channel and hitting the notification bell as we make videos about famous influencers who have been making a difference in the world. With this aside, let's begin with the video. Famously known as MKBHD, Marcus Keith Brownlee is a professional ultimate frisbee player with the New York Pony. He is the 2022 WFTF World Champion in the Open category for ultimate frisbee and a YouTuber widely known for his technology-focused videos and its postcard waveform. His popularity has earned him the name and the reputation of the best technology reviewer on the planet Vic Gondotra, who is a former senior vice president of Google. Marcus was born on the 3rd of December 1993 in Maplewood, New Jersey. He went to Columbia High School where he graduated in 2011 and studied at Howe School at Stevens Institute of Technology where he majored in Business and Information Technology. After his graduation, he became a full-time YouTuber and he produced most of his videos in his apartment. Now, he works out of a studio in Kearney, New Jersey, and today he is a successful YouTuber, tech blogger, and a podcaster. But before that, he is a professional ultimate frisbee player for the New York Empire after playing for Philadelphia Phoenix. He joined YouTube on the 21st of March 2008. However, he only started uploading technology videos in early 2009 those days when he was still in high school and he would make reviews about products he already owned. He had very humble beginnings with several hundred of his videos where hardware tutorials and freeware and he used to produce his videos through screencasting. Today, he has 5 YouTube channels and all of them are doing very well. He is some of the most innovative people you two have ever seen with his reviews being promoted by other reviewers as well and that includes websites too. With some of his videos reaching a million views on the first day, for example, the LG G Flex was showcased, where he performed different types of scratch tests to show the self-healing ability of the device and it has been going in views ever since also. Features interviews like back in December 2013, he featured the CEO of Motorola, Dennis Woodside, on his channel and also invited Ivan Blas starting his first over-the-air interview. Some of his videos like the scratch test and the review of a ruler 4.7-inch Sapphire display component for the iPhone 6, which was uploaded back on 7 July 2014, gained immediate popularity and the video was soon featured on famous websites like Forbes, The Half Post, The Verge, CNET and Time Magazine. The video even appeared on NBC News and in the newspapers all around the world. Today, the video has 10 million and millions of views. The main reason why this channel is successful in his in-depth review and attention to detail, he also interviewed a professional NBA player, Kobe Bryant, to talk about the shoe which Kobe designed, the Kobe 11. He has brought many amazing people to his channel, including Apple Senior Vice President of Software Engineering during the launch of MacBook Pro back in 2016. He also interviewed Nell deGrasse Tyson and the CEO of Tesla, Bill Gates and Satya Nadella for that matter. He is most notable for interviewing Barack Obama and discussing the use of technology and social media in government. He also has a series of YouTube originals known as Retro Tech produced by Vox Media Studios where MKBHD start and it was released on the 2nd of December 2019. The most important thing that I like about Brownlee is that he goes all in and if he wants to do something, he just does it and then gives his best at a time. YouTube was not even considered a career he was making for himself. Today, he has this astronomical success and he is a self-made man. That is what I like about him. This is the reason why his new channel has picked up a lot faster than other generic YouTubers who are just starting up. The experience he has is beyond comparison. It is estimated that he has a net worth of $40 million and he can easily make $750,000 a month. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you in the next one. Have a good day.